Aries, this is your November 24th through the 30th tarot reading. If Aries is your sun, moon, or rising sign, this reading is for you. And if any part of this reading resonates with you, please let me know by hitting that like button. And here we go. Ooh, the path. Waxing crescent with a number eight. Climbing the ladder. Ah, 58. Take the lead, stag spirit. You might be climbing up in your career. And you have go the distance. Wow, 47. Yeah. I feel like, yeah, you're definitely climbing the ladder of success, going the distance, taking the lead. Ten of pentacles. Four of wands. Page of swords. Page of wands. The Hermit, have some Virgo energy. And the Sun, Aries, you have some Leo energy here. The only major arcana, the only one. And it's a great one to have, too. This is beautiful. This is looking really, really positive. You have a lot of clarity at this time. You're communicating very effectively with yourself, with others, with the universe. And so let's take a look at what we can glean from the messages here. This is either your recent past or energy that you are still in right now. Ten of Pentacles. This is manifesting everything that you really need or desire here in the physical plane. I definitely feel like you are getting advice with the tarot here. I think maybe you actually went to a tarot reading or a psychic many years ago and was told something really significant about your future that has come true. I think you've told people about this with the Page of Wands. This could be a new idea, maybe from spirit, something that you're very passionate about. This could be communicating your passions and desires to other people. Let's keep going and we'll see if we get more messages regarding that. I think you're in a place of, you've done a lot of work here. You've accomplished a lot in your career. You might be retiring. I get a retirement feel with these. You don't have to be older to retire. You may have come to your success very young. Wow. Because you know, there are some people, Aries, that retire in their 20s, 30s. I get that vibe here. You came to your success very young and you were able to retire. I get that energy from these two cards. Sorry, I live next to a busy street. I think a pack of motorcycles just went by. I think you're enjoying your freedom. I think you are kind of a homebody sometimes. I think you're just enjoying this period of being at home because my four of wands is home it also can be marriage for some of you and we have this happy little corvid here i think your spirit guides are with you at this time now sometimes a hermit means that you've been through a dark night of the soul shadow work things like that I think you're just enjoying maybe some well-earned solitude, just being with your family. A little bit of a hermit mode, but, but in a good way. I think you're just wanting to be home because when you think about it, travel and vacations, it's, it's really a lot of work. It's not relaxing.
I think maybe you have a garden. Sorry about the road noise, you guys. I think you have a garden and you're just very content with your home life right now. We have another page here, which could be the young people in your life. You still could be very young here, Aries. This is a card of communication. This is, I think you took a time out after this big success here. And I think you, you know, took some time to just be at home, enjoying yourself. And I think now you're ready maybe to start a new adventure. You're starting to plan the Page of Swords. It's planning, thinking about the future here. I think the future is very bright for you. It's very clear. I think you're enjoying, you might have children now. I think you're enjoying your children if you have them. Or you have this youthful, childlike innocence and curiosity to the world because this is a page of swords. This is learning new things. This is just such a happy feeling here. This gives me these two right here, the page of swords and the, and the this inner child here. I feel like you're rediscovering yourself and the the little things that bring joy to your life. Cuz it's all the little things that make something really big. All the small moments combine for a big moment. So you might be embarking on a new adventure, a new path. You know, you might have a new idea percolating here with the Page of Swords. You might be learning something new. You might be thinking of a voyage here. This is voyage on this card. I feel like you are starting to think about traveling again after this period of being home. I think you might be ready to explore again, create new memories. This is a really a particular reading. This seems like it's very specific to a person that had success, rapid success at a young age, was able to retire early. And just because you retired doesn't mean you're not still actively doing things. I think you might have started doing consulting for other people. I'm getting that kind of energy with this too. Wow, this is just such a happy and amazing reading, Aries. Really great energy, but I feel like it's very specific. Maybe you're wanting to retire early so you can work from home. Because I get a very homebody vibe from here, which Aries, that's kind of, I don't know, You, I think you might have some Virgo, some Earth in your chart. I like it. It's good. Oh, we have the sun again. Look at that. The golden energy of the sun brings fame and fortune. Okay, you definitely are famous in some way, Aries. You had some kind of success early on. And I think you've just been enjoying it, being at home with your family. I think you've been able to take the lead with something somewhere. I think you're starting something new over here with the Page of Swords. Wow, Aries. Fire, 10. Let go of emotional upheaval. Embrace the renewal of the present. You have rainbow. The most difficult part of a situation is over. I get a pot of gold here. Maybe some of you... 
maybe you had a tumultuous beginning of your life, but then this is just wonderful. We have dog protection from a powerful friend. I feel like you might have a bodyguard. <laughs> Some of you, it, this is that kind of reading. This is very specific. We have ink pot. Problems to be resolved. You know, and I think you will with this page of swords. I think if there is a problem, you will do whatever it takes to find the people that can help you resolve a problem. And you will resolve it. You have the sun here twice twice. I feel like this might be a legal thing, you know, so be careful with that. You know, make sure all your ducks are in a row legally with your fame and fortune here, Aries. Wow. This is, this is a fame and fortune reading. You could have inherited something as a child. You may have come from a rich background because we have this 10 of pentacles there. You may have come from a wealthy family. But I think it's time to share your ideas with the world. Get get the spot. Oh, there's a spotlight on your ideas here with this sun and the page of swords. Something is spotlighting your ideas. This creative, um, inspirational card here. You're very wise for your age, I get as well, because we do have the hermit here. I think you're wise beyond your years here, Aries. I've never had a reading like this for you. I love this. I'm really curious how many people will resonate with this. Now, this Ten of Pentacles here, it doesn't have to necessarily be like millions and millions of dollars. You know what I'm saying? It could be a very secure, stable, everything you possibly need kind of upbringing. But I do feel success at an early age here. Retiring early. Something's wanting you to take the lead now in something new. And to really put all of your might into it, Aries. I do feel like right here, that momentum, that speed, that fire of the Aries wanting to charge ahead and go forward. But the, overall, this just looks great. If any part of this reading resonates with you, please let me know. Hit that like button. And the fire readings are on Fridays weekly. And then on Sundays, we have the bonus readings. Yep. If you would like a personal reading, look in the description box below for my Etsy link. And yeah, that's, that's a good message. That's all I have coming through right now, Aries. So I will see you next time.